Sounds like I'd better become a Mars Rover Monster Machine! Okay, that's pretty cool. Looking good, Rover Blaze. Thanks, Commander Megan. Now come on, AJ. Let's go find those engines. Yeah! Check it out! It's a giant dust storm! Lug nuts! On Mars, dust storms can get so big, they cover the whole planet. Uh-oh! One of our rocket ship engines is headed right for it! Hang on, AJ. We're going in after it. We're inside the dust storm! Yeah! How are we going to see the engine in all this dust? I know! Let's use one of our rover tools to help find it! Activating Weather Station! The Weather Station has sensors that can detect the weather and how much dust is in the air. According to our weather station, the engine flew into the smallest cloud. Which cloud is the smallest? That one! Yeah! And there's the engine! You're not getting away this time, engine! Yeah! Got it! Now let's hurry and get this engine back to the ship! Gaskets! That asteroid was so big it made a giant crater! The engine! It's getting away! To get over this crater, we've got to do the biggest jump we've ever done! A gravity super jump! Yeah! Check it out! Gravity is a force that pulls things together. On Earth, there's a lot of gravity. When you jump, gravity pulls you right back down to the ground. But on Mars, there's a lot less gravity, so you can jump really high before coming back down. Help me do a Mars gravity jump. Say, Mars gravity jump. Mars, Mars gravity, gravity jump! jump! Astronauts, we fixed our ship! Now we can fly back to planet Earth! Aw, but there are still so many pictures I want to take here on Mars! Like pictures of dry lake beds and impact basins and that dust storm! Dust storm? <laughs> Quick, everyone, back to the ship! away from that dust storm, we'd better blast off super fast! Prepare for rocket ship blazing speed! Let's blaze! Are you okay? We're stuck! This vine is too strong! I can't break free! Oh, that vine is really tough! <gasps> but I know something that can cut through it! Protractile claws! Hang on, Blaze! Ah! <laughs> Thanks, Stripes! Using your claws was a great idea! <gasps> Listen! Sounds like another racer's in trouble. Follow me. Guys, up here! It's Bam the Gorilla. Hang on, Bam. We'll get.
get you down? Help us figure out which vine we should cut to set Bam free. There's a vine with red leaves, a vine with purple leaves, and a vine with yellow leaves. Which vine is Bam tangled in? The vine with red leaves, yeah! Great cat! Claws! Sounds like Nelson the Rhino! Come on! I can't break free! Sit tight, Nelson! We'll get you out of there! Which vine should we cut to free Nelson? The vine with blue leaves! Yeah! <laughs> Boy, am I glad to be out of there. Hey, has anyone seen Bonk? Help! This way! Look, there he is. We'll get you down, Bonk! Now there are four vines. To save Bunk, which vine should we cut? The vine with orange leaves! Yeah! Cannonball! Alright! Oh, thanks, fellas! We're just glad we got everyone out of those vines! And now we can get back into the race! Man, but we're really far behind! Don't give up, guys! If we do our best, we can still win! Yeah! That's right! Now, come on! Follow me! Yeah. It's Crusher! Uh-oh! He's so far ahead! <laughs> that trophy's gonna be mine! We gotta do something! Hang on, everyone! I know a way we can catch up with Crusher. We can use Blazing Speed! Give me and my animal friends blazing speed. Say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! <laughs> I'm almost at the finish line. Nobody can beat me now, especially not those five racers speeding up behind me. Wait, what? Uh, I win. you two. And remember, no matter what, Mail Trucks, trucks Always Deliver! Mail Trucks Always Deliver Mail Trucks Always Deliver They travel all over the world Nobody does it better They carry a box Delivery, we have to bring a key to the pirate so he can open his treasure chest. Come on, AJ, this way. Mail truck blazes on the way. Hmm, I wonder what's making that strange chomping sound. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Chomp, chomp, chomp. I don't know. But something tells me we're about to find out! Pumpcats! Oh man! The sharks are trying to 
Chomper Boo! Chomp, 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 chomp. Well, we've got to find some way to get past them. We've got a delivery to make. Hey, I've got an idea. To get past the sharks, let's use a wave. Waves move energy from one place to another. If we make a big splash, that energy will travel through the water and create an ocean wave that can carry the sharks away. That's a great idea. Come on, let's give it a try. Look, here comes a shark. <laughs> Help us send him away with a really big wave. Say, wave. Wave! Help us make an even bigger wave this time. Say, wave! There, we'll have to get past the most sharks yet. Help us make a really, really big wave. Shout, wave! Special delivery, pirate! Shiver me timbers! The key! <laughs> now I can finally open me treasure chest! So, what is it, pirate? Yeah, what's inside? The treasure be... Pirate snacks! <laughs> Help build the parts to turn me into a thunderboat. First, I need the planing hull. It keeps the thunderboat floating high on top of the water. To make the planing hull, say planing hull. Planing hull! Next, I'll need a propeller. When the propeller spins, it pushes the boat forward. To make the propeller, say propeller. Propeller! Last, I'll need two powerful engines to make our Thunderboat go really fast. To make the engines, say, engines. Engines! Oh, yeah! I'm a Thunderboat monster machine! Whoa! Hop in, AJ, and give me some Thunderboat speed! Oh. Balls are coming from. I think I know where. It's those pirates. Fire the cannonball! Phew! Those pirates sure love sinking ships. Well, they're not gonna sink us, because I've got an idea. Look! See that rock in the water? It's shaped like a ramp. Yeah! If we drive our Thunderbolt fast enough off a ramp, we can jump over the pirate ships. Come on, let's go for it! Activating speedometer view! To jump over the red pirate ship, we need to go a speed of 30. Let's count by tens to 30. Repeat after me. 10, 10, 20. 20, 30, 30! Oh, 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 oh. We made it past the red 
pirate! Yeah. Oh no! Crusher and Pickle are about to crash into the slime volcano! Gaskets! If we're gonna save them in time, we've gotta go faster! Let's increase our speed all the way to 100! 100? Whoa! We've never gone that fast before! But we can do it, because we've got blazing speed! <laughs> to give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! <laughs> Check our speedometer to see if we're going 100. Is the arrow pointing to 100? Yes! <laughs> we're coming, Crusher and Pickle! Something's turning all our friends into babies! <laughs> oh, look! It's some kind of baby robot from outer space! Thanks to me, Planet Earth will soon become Planet Baby! <laughs> <laughs> For a mission this important, I'm gonna need some special upgrades! Time to become... Special Mission Blaze! Special Mission Blaze thinks about becoming Special Mission Baby! <laughs> that was close! That blast from the robot's baby ray almost turned us into babies! How are we gonna stop him? Hey, I've got an idea! What if we block those blasts with one of our special mission modes? Special mission for S.H.I.E.L.D. Not giving up, eh, special mission players? Well, let's see what you think about five blasts from my baby ray. 
Subtraction to see if we blocked them all. The robot launched five blasts. And we just knocked away three of them with our force shield. Five take away three equals this many. What number is this? Two! Right! There are two blasts left. Not for long. One! Blaze! No! I give up! I'm getting off of this planet and going back to outer space! Hey, look! The baby robot has a big button on his back! Yeah! That must be the button to make all the babies big again! But we've got to press it fast before the robot gets back to outer space! It's time to use Special Mission Blazing Speed! Give me blazing speed. Say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! Now, instead of turning everyone into babies, I feel like doing this. <laughs> Making everyone big again. Undersea racers, on your marks, get set. Let's tell Blaze when it's time to start racing. When the light turns green, say go. says we should go this way. Come on! Hmm, that's strange. I don't see the other racers around here anywhere. Me neither. We must have made a wrong turn. A really wrong turn! Look out! Whoa! 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 Oh, man! Those things are blasting giant balls of seaweed! If we're gonna get back in the race, we've gotta find some way past those seaweed blasters! Whoa! Did you hear that? Wow! It's a sea star! And it looks like she knows karate! Hey, sea star! Can your karate help us get past those giant balls of seaweed? Karate chop! Ah! Come on, Sea Star! Time to chop our way out of here! Hi -ya, hi -ya. Submarine! Ah! Look out! Those blasters are about to blast more seaweed! Let's count how many balls of seaweed are headed this way. Count with me! One, One two, two, three! Three, three chops coming up! <laughs> One, two, three. Hey, look! We're almost back to the racetrack! But to get there, we'll have to make it past these last seaweed blasters. Count the seaweed with me. One, two, three, four, five, six! Now 
let's get chopping! Sea Star? Yeah! You helped us get back in the race! <laughs> now come on, AJ! Let's hurry so we can catch up with the other racers! Submarine, go! <laughs> Lights, look! It's Crusher Submarine! There's the giant sandcastle! That's the finish line to the Deep Sea Grand Prix! If we don't hurry, Crusher's gonna get there first! Oh no, he's not! Because we've got submarine blazing speed! To give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! And the winner of the Deep Sea Grand Prix! little crabs. And for coming in first place, look what you've won! Whoa! It's a trophy! That's right! It's the Undersea Trophy! Whoa! Hubcaps! Someone's trying to cover the whole city in grossy goo! But who'd want to do that? The, the yucky, yucky ducky. ducky? Thanks to my grossy goo machine, soon everything in Axel City will be sticky and gross. Just like me! <laughs> oh man! We can't let the yucky ducky get away with this. We've got to stop that grossy goo machine. For a mission this important, we're going to need some high tech upgrades. Time to become Special Mission Blaze! All right! Check it out! Blaze has brand new special mission modes! This button activates color changing mode! I can use this to disguise myself! by changing colors! This button activates flying drone mode! Now I've got the power to fly! This last button activates water blaster mode! With my water blaster, I can make a super powerful water blast! With these upgrades, I've got the power to stop the yucky ducky and her grossy goo machine! I'm Special Mission Blaze! Quackity quack, quackity quack! Special Mission Blaze is getting closer! to stop him before he ruins all my yucky plans! Well, he'll never get through that tunnel once I activate my super assembly! Stay lasers! Do you guys smell that? Please, look out! Whoa. Oh no! This tunnel is full of stink lasers! Hmm. Well, we can't drive past all those lasers, but maybe we can fly past them! Flying drone mode! Yeah! Wow! Special mission blast! Up 
ahead! Hubcaps! That tunnel just closed shut! Try another one, Blaze! Uh-oh! That one closed too! To get out of here, we need to figure out which tunnel stays open. Hmm. According to our computer, we can only fly through tunnels that have lasers with primary colors. The primary colors are red, yellow, and blue. Look carefully. Which tunnel has lasers that are red, yellow, and blue? That one, right! <laughs> We've almost made it out of here. We just have to get through one last tunnel of stink lasers. Which tunnel has lasers that are the primary colors? That tunnel, yeah! was close. Uh-oh, but look! Those blaster jets destroyed all the bridges! Now we can't drive to the finish line! Well, if we can't drive there, then let's use our power tires and fly there! Yeah! We can give them rocket power! To give our tires rocket power, say rocket power! We'll trap those blaster jets in something sticky. Yeah, we can use adhesion. Check it out. I've got tape and a basketball. Which one's sticky, tape or a basketball? The tape, right. One of the blaster jets got stuck to the tape. But there are still more blaster jets chasing us. Quick, let's find something else that's sticky. Let's see. I've got a paper clip and maple syrup. Which one's sticky? A paper clip or maple syrup? Maple syrup, yeah! Time for some... There's only one blaster jet left! Oh! To stop this last blaster jet, we could use glue or water. Which one's sticky? Glue or water? <laughs> Almost there! Almost there! <laughs> We've only got one chance left. It's time to use Power Tire Blazing Speed! Whoa! 
to give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! And the winner is to Sky High Mountain, how are we going to celebrate? Oh, I've got an idea. What do you say we use our power tires to celebrate with some ice cream power? Looks like we'll need a special vehicle to collect all these trash bags. Yeah, we need a garbage truck. Garbage trucks follow a sequence for collecting trash. Pick up the bags, toss them in the hopper, compact them to make room for more. Pick up, toss, compact. That's the sequence. Well, to follow that sequence, I'd better become Garbage Truck Blaze! Ooh! Let's give our trash collecting sequence a try. First, we pick up the trash bags. Okay. Then we toss them in the hopper. <laughs> and last, we come back. Now, come on, Crusher. Let's go collect some garbage. Help us look for trash bags. When you see a trash bag, say, trash bag. <laughs> trash bag! Pick up, toss, and come back! Yeah! Keep looking. If you see any more trash bags, say, trash bag. Trash bag! Pick up, toss, come back! Yeah! We did it! We got all the trash bags! Wow, nice trash collecting! Yay! For a job this big, I'd say you've earned 12 truck bucks! <laughs> oh, yeah. Pleasure working with you, fellas! Oh, oh, there it is! I'd like one super skateboard, please. That'll be 50 truck bucks. Here you go! <laughs> yeah. All right! This way to Grammy's birthday party. But there's still one thing missing. Grammy! Oh, Crusher! You made it! <laughs> Look, Grammy, we got you a present! Oh, is that a super skateboard? It sure is, Grammy. Do you like it? I like it! Oh, I love it! Oh, thank you. All of you. <laughs> Aww. You're welcome, Grammy. Now, what do you say we give my new skateboard a try? Together! Come <laughs> <laughs> on, boys. Grammy's not getting any younger. <laughs> Yay! 
Let's build our own wings. We'll transform me from a truck to a Falcon Monster Machine. First, let's make the tail feathers. Falcons need those to help them steer. To make tail feathers, say, tail feathers. Tail feathers! Now I need strong talons for grabbing things. To make the talons, say, talons. Talons! And last, the most important part, the wings, so we can fly. To make the wings, say, wings. Wings! Oh, yeah! I'm a falcon monster machine! We've got to hurry and get to that starting line. All right! <laughs> yeah! Super Sky Racing, here we come! Falcon Fly! Falcons, Falcons, the world's fastest animals. With body shape to make them fly fast. Yeah. And talons powerful, a strong grasp. Eyesight both sharp and clear. Nobody can beat me, cause I'm Thunder, what? Blaze is ahead of me? Oh no, no, no! I can't let him win! <laughs> Phew! <laughs> He's almost at the finish line! Come on, we can still beat him. I just need to fly super fast with blazing speed. Yeah! Give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! There. Thanks, everyone. Hey, you! <gasps> it's Thunderwing! There's something I want to say to you. Congratulations! You really all want amazing flyer. Hello, Fireflies! Oh, hello there! Such a fine day to take our egg for a walk. Isn't it just the loveliest egg you've ever seen? It sure is. Little firefly egg glowing! 
We're so excited for our egg to hatch. Fireflies, we'll get your egg. Hmm, the egg must be here somewhere. Help us look for it. Is the egg over here? No, let's look someplace else. Is the egg over here? No. Is the egg way up there? Yes, there it is, at the top of that building. Uh-oh, but how are we going to get all the way up there? Ooh, Zeg have idea. Grasshopper Zeg, jump to egg. Yeah, grasshoppers are amazing jumpers. Their big hind legs have powerful muscles inside. And when they push off the ground, they can jump super high. So all we need are things for Zeg to jump on. And he can jump all the way up there. Hmm, but what Zeg jump on? Hey, up here. I can help you! As can I! Me too, dearies! This is great! Zeg, those caterpillars can help you jump to the top! Oh, goody! Get ready, caterpillars! Here come Grasshopper Zeg! Where Zeg jump? Quick, let's help Zeg find another caterpillar. Where do you see a caterpillar? Yeah, there's one. Whoa. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Where do you see a caterpillar? There. Whoa. Jumping, Zeg. <laughs> that fun. Thank you, caterpillars. <laughs> You're welcome, big fella. Anytime. Come on, everyone. The firefly egg went this way. Follow me. in time, too. Look! Our egg! It's hatching! Oh! Mama! Dada! So cute! <laughs> Check me out! I'm a laser blasting monster machine! Through metal with light, laser light. Yeah, we're free. Watch out, Blaze. That crane just dropped four pipes. Help me use my laser to cut through all four. Count to four with me. One, two, three. All right! Only one crane left! Uh-oh! But it's throwing seven pipes! Count to seven with me! 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The light thief. <laughs> okay, light thief. Time to give back all those lights. No, I, I can't give the lights back. I need them. But why? Why do you need so many lights? Without the lights, it's dark. Well, I'm, I'm afraid of the dark. <laughs> Oh, you're afraid of the dark. No wonder she took all those lights. <laughs> hey, don't worry. It's okay to be afraid of the dark. Yeah, everyone's afraid sometimes. But you don't have to have all these lights to make you feel better. Sometimes, just a little bit of light is all you need. Whoa, look at that. A tiny light just for me. So, how do you feel now? Uh, I don't feel afraid anymore! <laughs> I'm not afraid, cause now I see! A little light's enough for me! <laughs> Thank you, Monster Machines! I'm really sorry I took all the lights. And I promise, I'll never do it again! Yay! Good for you! Oh yeah! I'm a speedboat! Whoa! Awesome! Get ready to go, team! I'm increasing the propeller's rotational speed to 50! Look! Here comes a fountain! Those fountains are gonna keep flooding the racetrack unless someone turns them off! I can do it. All I need are my water skis. Yeah! Woohoo! Go, Gabby! Okay, Fountain, time to turn you off. She shut off that fountain. All right! Now come on, let's turn off the rest of these fountains. Whenever you see a fountain, say fountain. Now keep looking. When you see the next fountain, say fountain. Fountain! Yeah! Only one more to go. When you see the last fountain, say fountain. Going down. All right, yeah. Now come on, we've got a race to win. Look, there's Crusher. He's almost at the finish line. Hang on, guys. We're gonna catch him. Oh no! Blaze and his team are right behind me. I've got to hurry and do one last big cheat. <laughs> I'm going to use this remote to turn on the giant magnet. What's wrong, Blaze? Something's pulling me backwards. Look, it's that giant magnet. Now, that magnet is really strong. To drive away from it, Blaze needs to speed up and spin his tires 
really fast. Yeah, we need their rotational speed to be 100. I know how we can make my tires spin that fast. We can use blazing speed. To give my tires blazing speed, say, let's blaze. Let's blaze. Look, his tires rotational speed is at 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. It's a great win! Now come on, let's celebrate! Hi, tire teammates! Yeah! Alright! Space races! Start your rocket engines! to steer our ships so the bighorns can't bump us. We need to use thrust. Ah. Right now, our engines are making a thrust that pushes us forward. But if we turn our engines, the blast will create a thrust that can push us up or down or any direction we want to go. Quick, change thrust direction. Ah. Now, come on, everyone, follow me. Help me look for the other space bighorns so we can steer past them. When you see a space bighorn, say, space bighorn. Space bighorn! <laughs> Change thrust direction! <laughs> There's just one space bighorn left. Help us look for it. When you see the last space bighorn, say, space bighorn. Space bighorn! <laughs> Change press direction! Uh -oh. <laughs> astronaut AJ. Nice flying spaceship, Blaze. And look! See that planet? That's where the finish line is! <laughs> oh no! The Crusher is 
almost there! <laughs> I'm gonna win the space race and be the champion of the universe! Me! Space Crusher! To give me and my alien friends blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's All I need now is a picture of myself winning! Save! <laughs> 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 we did it! He won the great space race! Well, friends, the race may be over, but we've still got our spaceships! Yeah! What do you say we go flying one more time? Agreed! Yeah. Let's do it! <laughs> Powers back. But there's got to be some way to break out of these snapper trappers. Only one animal has the right stuff to break out of this trap. A lion! Yeah! Lions have protractile claws in their feet. Whenever they want to, they can pop them out. Lions' claws are great for climbing and hunting food. And they'd be perfect for cutting open these traps. Come on! Let's turn me into a lion monster machine! First, we need a mane. That's the long hair that goes around the lion's head. To make the mane, say, mane. Mane! All right! Now for the most important part, sharp protractile claws. To make the protractile claws, say, protractile claws. Protractile claws! Oh, yeah! I'm a lion monster machine! Your turn, Stripes! Whoa! I'm Super Tiger Stripes! Ready, Super Tiger Stripes? Ready! Then let's show these guys what lions and tigers can do! Get these powers back to the animals where they belong! I can fly! My trunk! There, there, Lazard. Let it out. Lazard, those animal powers didn't belong to you. Yeah, they belong to all the animals. Oh, but I want a cool animal power, too. I mean, everybody else has one but me. <laughs> <gasps> what? You just changed your color. Change my color? 
I can't change my color. Whoa! You did it again! Whoa! Look at that! Lazard, you do have a cool animal power. You have the power to change colors. You're a chameleon! I'm a chameleon! Woo! Who knew? Oh, oh, be yellow! Not be purple! With orange polka dots! <laughs> <laughs> Please, um, I just want to say that I'm really, really sorry that I took everyone's animal powers and I'll never do it again. I promise. That sounds good to me. Blaze, look! There's our sail! Lug nuts! It's blowing away! Come on, we're gonna need everyone's help to catch that sail. What are we gonna do, Pickle? We're never gonna find another sail! Never, ever, ever! Blaze's sail. Not for long. Come on, Pickle. We're gonna take that sail and use it for our boat. Gee, I, I don't think that's such a good idea. <laughs> Look! Here's our sail! It blew all the way up to the top of that mountain. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> oh, no! Crusher's trying to take our sail. You've got to get up that mountain before he does. Hey, I know. We can get to the sail super fast if we use wind power. We can use a kite. Kites use wind power to push them high in the sky. Let's build a kite so we can fly up and get that sail. First, I need a flying line. That's the long string that lets you control where the kite goes. To make the flying line, say, flying line. Flying line! Great. Next, we need a reel to control how high the kite flies. To make the reel, say, reel! Reel! Now, to give the kite its shape, we need a frame. Say, frame! Frame! And last but not least, we need a cover so the wind has something to push against. Say, cover! Cover! Check it out! I'm a kite flying! Monster Machine! Whoa! You make an awesome kite, Blaze! Thanks, guys! Now grab onto that reel! This kite is ready to fly! Oh, yeah! It's working! The wind is pushing you higher! Finally, that sail is all mine! Oh, hey! It's Blaze the Kite! Blaze the what? <laughs> we got the sail! All right! Okay, guys, bring us down! That was amazing! Thanks! Now let's put this sail back on our boat so we can all go home. Ta-da! Our boat is fixed. Nice work, Gabby. Yeah! Now we can sail back to Axel City. <laughs> Guess what, Slowpokes? I fixed my sailboat first! Uh, Crusher, your boat doesn't look very fixed. And that's not a sail. It's a pair of pants. Ah! My sailboat is the best boat. It's number one! Except for the fact that it's sinking! Sinking? Ah! Quick, we've got to help them. Aye, aye, Captain Blaze. Here, grab onto these. Hooray! Blaze saved us! Oh, Blaze, you're my hero! Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! You're welcome, Pickle. Now let's set sail for Axel City! We're going home! Oh, no! Yeah! 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 Well, at least 
last I can finally relax. Yep, from here on out, it's smooth sailing. That giant octopus is blocking the whole tunnel. <laughs> Maybe I can push him out of the way. Lug nuts! This robo octopus is too big. Then how are we going to move it? Hmm. It may be too big to push, but nothing is too big to float. When something floats, it goes up to the top of the water. So if we attach enough things that float to the octopus, it'll lift him up and out of our way. Hey, look! I bet we can find things that float in that old shipwreck. Come on, let's check it out. It looks like this chest has forks inside, and this chest has beach balls. When I let go, which do you think will float? The fork? or the beach ball. Let's find out. The beach ball, it's floating. Beach balls float because they're full of air. Quick, let's get all the beach balls and stick them on the octopus. Yeah! It's working. Some of the octopus's arms are getting pulled to the top of the water. Come on, let's go find more things that float. This chest is full of hammers, and this chest has tire tubes. Which do you think will float, the hammer or the tube? Let's check and see. The tube is floating! Even though it's bigger than the hammer, the air inside the tire tube makes it float. Look! More of the octopus's arms are floating! We just need one more thing to float the octopus away. I found a drum and a frying pan. Which do you think will float? Let's see. The drum floats. Yeah, it's full of air too. Come on. We did it. The Robo Octopus is floating away. All right. Yeah. We got the crown. Hmm. I wonder where Crusher and his submarine ended up. been a lot worse. Uh -oh. <laughs> Fun! Can we do that again? <laughs> There's a mud pit. And there's Zeg. Zeg's still stuck. Ugh. Oh, man. We gotta hurry and get Zeg out of that mud. Come on, let's use blazing speed so we can get there super fast. To give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze. Let's blaze. But Blaze, how are we going to get to Zeg? We can't drive on the mud, or else we'll get stuck too. I know. 
we can design a solution. We just got to imagine a way to get to Zeg without touching the mud. Blaze, what if you had big wings like those trichodactyls? Then you could fly over to Zeg and pull them out. Yeah, let's figure out how to build wings so I can fly like a trichodactyl. For our design, we'll need supports to give the wings their shape. To make the supports, say, supports. Supports! Good! Now the wings need a super light film. The super light film pushes against the air and helps us fly. To build it, say, super light film. Super light film! I'm a truckadactyl monster machine! Nice wings, Blaze! Let's test them out! Whoa, I'm flying! All right! Our design is working! Come on, let's go get Zeg! Bubbles. Wait, did he just say mud bubbles? Whoa! Uh oh, we gotta keep away from those sticky mud bubbles. Help me steer around them so I don't get hit. When you see bubbles coming, say mud bubbles. Mud bubbles! Get ready! More bubbles are coming. Whenever you see them, say mud bubbles. Mud bubbles! Mud bubbles! with a waterproof hull so we can go underwater. And a propeller to make it move really fast. And an electric toothbrush that can reach out and brush the fish's teeth. Yeah! We use mechanical engineering to make a monster machine toothbrush sub! All right! Let's go brush some teeth. Now, where did those silly fish go? <gasps> Sounds like one's hiding over there. Help us look for him. Where do you see a fish? Right there, hiding in the seaweed. Yeah! <laughs> okay, fishy. Ready to brush those teeth? Uh -huh. <laughs> there, all done. Listen, sounds like there's another fish hiding over there. Let's look. Where do you see the fish? There, behind that rock. 
And it sounds like he's over this way. Where do you see the fish? Up there, yeah! Okay, little fish, say ah! There, all finished! Now come on, little fishies. Let's show Dentist Brody your nice, clean teeth. They're back! Oh, wow! Look at all those clean teeth! You fish of all earned stickers! <laughs> and for being such good dentists, you guys have earned this! Another coin! All right! Coins for the supersized prize machine. Well, then, this last prize is all yours. Yeah! You ready to see what our supersized prize is? Okay, here goes. Whoa, look! It's a marshmallow! And it keeps getting bigger, and bigger, and bigger! I don't believe it! It's a super-sized marshmallow! Oh, oh, oh. Look at the size of that marshmallow! Come on, friends! It's marshmallow time! Oh, oh man! It's fun and delicious! Woohoo! Who could do it? A flying squirrel! Yeah! Flying squirrels have special flaps called patagia. The patagia lets them catch the wind like a parachute and glide through the air. Oh, oh! I could do it! I could be a flying squirrel! Yeah! Let's turn Darrington into a flying squirrel monster machine! Look at me! I'm a flying squirrel monster machine! Looking good, partner. Now stand back, everyone. I'm going to glide to that lever. Swirling time! <laughs> Nothing can stop flying Squirrel Darrington. Except maybe those storm clouds. Ah! To get through this storm, I've got to fly through those spaces between the clouds. But I can only fit through the biggest space. Help me look! Which space between the clouds is the biggest? <laughs> that one! Yeah! <laughs> I'm almost there. I've just got to get past these last storm clouds. Which space is the biggest? That one! Here I Coming back! Yay! Did it! Oh, right. Way to go, Darrington! Thanks, guys! Being a flying squirrel was one wild glide! <laughs> guys, look! That's the mountain where Tooks is trapped! Come on, y'all! We 
sure are glad to have you back, Tooks. Oh, thanks, Blaze. You monster machines are the best friends a toucan could ever ask for. Hey, y'all, now that we've got our whole team back, what do you say we go play some Jungle Ball? Yeah! Let's do it! Come on! Well, sorry to say, but it looks like there won't be any more Jungle Ball today. Wait a second. What is that? Blaze and his friends have rescued Toots. I can't believe it. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm so happy Toots is back. Who can say that again? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Now, come on. Let's play ball. Nelson has the ball. Oh, oh, I'm open. He passes the bam. Oh, ah. but now Blaze has it. Blaze passes to Starla. She passes to Darrington. Up to Toots. Now back to Blaze. He's almost at the goal. But to score, he'll have to get the ball past Bob the Elephant. No way! You ready, Toots? Oh, yeah. I got this. you guys hey who's ready to play again i am you know I am. <laughs> oh, yeah. good news guys we're almost at my house for the ice cream party all right that is great news gasquatch yep it's just on the other side of that mountain the mountain it's shaking huh that's strange i don't think the mountain has ever rumbled like that before whoa Wait a second. I don't think that's a mountain. That's a volcano! And it's oozing out hot lava. Gaskets, lots of hot lava. And it's going everywhere. Oh, no. The lava's blocking our way. We'll never get to my ice cream party now. <laughs> don't give up, Gasquatch. I've got an idea. What if we change this lava from a liquid to a solid? Yeah! When rocks underground get super hot, they melt, changing from a solid into liquid called lava. And when a volcano erupts, all that hot lava comes oozing out. But if we can make the lava get cold, we can change it from a liquid back into solid rock. Then it will be safe to drive on. Wow! That's a great plan! But how are we going to cool off hot lava? Leave that to me, Gasquatch. Activating Ice Cream Blaster! It's working! All that cold ice cream is turning the lava into solid rock! Come on, Gasquatch. Follow me! But we better keep on the lookout. Yeah, there's gotta be more lava where that came from. Tell me when you see lava so I can freeze it with my ice cream blaster. If you see any more lava, say lava. Lava! the volcano with ice cream. Just another reason why I love ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Gasquatch, isn't that your house? Oh, that is my house. We're so close to my ice cream party. <laughs> but all the friends I invited, they're even closer. <laughs> My friends are gonna get there, and they won't have any ice cream! Don't worry, Gasquatch. We'll get the ice cream there in time. We just need some blazing speed! Oh, yeah! To give Gas 
Sasquatch and me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's Just in time! Look! All your friends are here! Yay! Howdy, Gasquatch! Oh, I'm so glad you all made it! This is gonna be the most delicious ice cream party ever! Oh, say, like ice cream? Yeah, ice cream's my favorite! <laughs> okay, ice cream truck blaze! Ready to do your thing? Ready! Then let's have an ice cream party! Teams, on your marks, get set, go! <laughs> I can't wait to get to the finish line and win that dinosaur trophy. <laughs> Pico, what are you doing? Oh, you know, just practicing using my tail. Y your tail? Oh, yeah. Dinosaurs use their tails to stay protected from dangerous things like other dinosaurs and crocodiles and pants. Pants? No way. I'm sure dinosaurs don't need to worry about pants. Oh, no. That sounded like Blaze and Sand. It's not fair. I want to win the Dino Derby. I want to win the Dino Derby. <laughs> I want to win the Dino Whoa. Hang on, Dinosaur Team. What do you think that rumbling sound is? Ooh, Zagno. That sound of groundbreaking. Oh, that's not good. Hubcaps. <laughs> We landed in some kind of underground cave. <laughs> Looks like your team's in a whole lot of trouble. <laughs> I get it. Because you're in a hole. <laughs> oh, team not win race if team stuck down here. Hey, don't worry, Zeg. We'll find a way out of here. <laughs> Look! Trucodactyl flying out of cave. Gaskets. That means there must be more Trucodactyls living in these caves. And if we can find them, they can fly us out of here. Oh, Zeg know how to find more. Zeg use coordinates. Yeah. Visor, show us coordinates to find a Trucodactyl. The coordinates are three, four. We start with the number three. Let's count over three caves. Count with us. One. Two, three. Good. Now the second number is four. So we count up four. Count with us. One, two, three, four. Ah! All right. We use coordinates to find a trucodactyl. Oh, trucodactyl. Can you give sake right? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Trucodactyl! Come on, help me find one last Trucodactyl. The coordinates are four, six. Count over four with me. One, two, three, four. <laughs> yeah! Now let's count up six. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> hey, Trucodactyl, think I can get a ride? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for your help, Trucodactyl. 
friends. Bye, friends. I can't let them beat me now. I need one last cheat. Something like, like this. <laughs> I hope Blaze and Zeg aren't dinosaur losers. <laughs> The dinosaur gate! It's closing! Uh-oh! Bad, bad! The only way we're gonna make it before that gate closes is to go super fast! Time to use dinosaur blazing speed! <laughs> to give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! Jay, you best teammate Zag ever have! I got you, Starla! Thanks, Blaze! That was close! So what do we do now? If we try to drive from these old train track rails, we'll fall off! Hmm. These rails weren't made for monster machines. To ride on them, we need a steam engine. Yeah! Steam engines are trains that use the power of boiling. They have a firebox inside that heats up a tank of water until it reaches 100 degrees. Then, steam from the boiling water pushes against pistons so the train can drive. Well, sure we! Let's make a steam engine and ride these rails. First, we need a firebox. That's the part that heats the water. To make the firebox, say, firebox. Firebox! Next, we need the boiler. That's the tank that holds all the boiling water. To make the boiler, say, boiler. Boiler! Great! Now all we need are the pistons. When the boiling water changes into steam, it pushes the pistons to make the train go. To make the pistons, say pistons. Pistons! Oh, yeah! I'm a steam engine monster machine! Wow! All aboard! Oh, steam ahead! Oh. Now we're back on track! Wait! Watch out! The rails split up ahead! And one way leads to a dead end! Quick! Help me choose which way to go! Should we take the bottom path or the top path? The top path! Yeah! Should we take the top path or the bottom path? The top path, yeah! Starla? Ride up, cowboy! Ready? Set! Ride!
one crazy ride. You said it. It's the wildest track in the Wild West. Awesome, you two. Come on, let's keep going. Sure, I and keep up. Yeah! Nice driving, Gabby! Uh oh, falling rocks. Watch, look out! Watch, your tire is coming loose. Are you all right, Watts? Uh, I'll be okay. Just as soon as I can get that tire back. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Hang on, Watts. You can't drive like that. Yeah, not with one of your tires missing. But then, what'll I do? Let me help you, Watts. With Blaze and AJ, I'll find your tire. I promise. Come on, gang. We've got a tire to find. All right! Be on the lookout. Watts's tire has got to be close. Where do you see Watts's tire? Yeah, there it is. Hurry, Blaze. It rolled into that cave. You got it. <laughs> huh. Do you guys hear that? It sounds like snoring. It's... Sleeping bighorns! We better be quiet. We do not want to wake up a sleeping bighorn. <laughs> Look! There goes Watts' tire! Uh-oh! But that bighorn is blocking the tunnel! To get to the tire, we've got to find some way to get past him. Hmm. What we need is a machine that's strong enough to lift a big horn without waking him up. We need a grapple truck. I'm a grapple truck monster machine. Wahoo! All right, it's grappling time. Now, to pick up that big horn, we have to get our grapple claw right over him. To get our claw over the big horn, should we move our claw this way and follow the red arrow? Or this way and follow the blue arrow? Blue arrow, yes! Grapple claw, grab! All right! We moved the big horn without waking him up! Come on, let's keep going! Look, there's Watts' tire! Lug nuts! But that big horn went to sleep right on top of it! We'll have to be super careful to get the tire without waking up this big horn. To pick up this last big horn, which arrow should we follow? The red arrow! Yeah! Grapple claw, grab! <laughs> and now we can finally get Watts' tire! Yes! We got the tire! Ugh. Whoa, whoa. Wait a second, that sounds like... That's right, Watts. Now let's get it back on you where it belongs. Fasteners, please. Oh, yeah! Go, Watts! Phew. Feel 
feels good to be driving again. Thanks, you guys. You're welcome, Watts. We're just happy to see that you're all better. Yo, let's hit the seas. Let's sail, get ready. Aye, aye. Aye. Let's play. Two, three, and four. Here we go. All aboard. Seven, eight. Eight. Let's play. Yeah. Yeah. Good news, crew. According to the map, the green emerald key is somewhere right around here. Har, we best get looking for it. When you see the key, say key. Key. Ha <laughs> ha! There it is. But wait. That's strange. Now I see another ship with a big horn. <laughs> Shiver me timbers. Those be <laughs> pirate big horns. <laughs> These pirate big horns keep bumping our boat. Hey, bumping boats be their favorite thing. <laughs> Oh no! The pirate bighorns are blocking the way to the last key! <laughs> oh, woe is me! We'll never get to the key now! <laughs> Don't give up, Pegwheel! To get past those bighorns, we just need a machine that can blow their ships right out of our way! We need a vortex cannon! Remember, a vortex is a fluid that spins around in a circle. In a vortex cannon, that spinning fluid is air, and it spins around like this. If a blast of that spinning air hits the bighorn ship, it'll blow it far away. Avast! There be a pirate bighorn heading this way! <laughs> Help me aim my vortex cannon. If we aim here, will our vortex hit the bighorn ship? No! Big wheel! Steer the ship a little to the right! Aye aye, AJ! Now will our vortex hit the bighorn ship? Yes! Yo ho, vortex! <laughs> Captain Bighorn! <laughs> if we aim here, Will our vortex hit Captain Bighorn's ship? No! <laughs> Big Wheel, turn the ship! Huzzah! Now will our vortex hit Captain Bighorn's ship? No, we've got to turn back the other way. Yar! Now will our vortex hit Captain Bighorn's ship? Yes! Yo ho, Vortex! <laughs> now let's go get that emerald key! <laughs> we got him! Oh, hardy har, we found all three, cause now we've got the emerald! Right, crew, get your keys ready. Blue Sapphire Key! Red Ruby Key! Green Emerald Key! Tears opening! Get ready, everyone. We're finally gonna see the treasure. It's golden balloons! Huzzah! Look, there's more! Golden instruments! Wow! Shiver me timbers! Golden pirate hats! Ooh. Hats, music, and balloons! I don't believe it! The golden treasure is...
beams! Straight ahead! Come on! Let's hurry and catch up! Ooh, a shortcut! This'll totally get me ahead of the other racers! <laughs> oh, wait. But taking a shortcut is cheating. And Blaze said we shouldn't cheat. Ah, but what does he know? It's just one little cheat. <laughs> shortcut, shortcut, shortcut. Shortcut, shortcut, shortcut. Uh-oh. I can't move. I'm stuck. Hey, that sounds like Crusher. Oh, no. Crusher tried to cheat. And now he's stuck! Get me out of here! Don't worry, Crusher. We'll pull you out. Yeah. Oh, it's no use. I'm gonna be stuck in here forever! Man, Crusher is really stuck. To get him out, we need a machine with super pulling power. Oh, yeah! I'm a tow truck! Huh, I wonder what that noise was. Oh, it's just a bunch of grizzly bears. <laughs> a bunch of grizzly bears? <laughs> Blaze! Hurry! So Like you can't get me down! <laughs> I was wrong. Yeah. Let's get out of here! Crusher, yeah. yeah. <laughs> look! You made those bananas fall! And now some of the bears are sliding off the track. Huh, good job by me. I'm not gonna cheat. I'm not gonna cheat. Yeah they passed the yellow team. I'm not gonna cheat. I'm not gonna cheat. And the blue team. I'm not gonna cheat. I'm not gonna cheat. And the green team. There's just one team left to pass, but they're almost at the finish line. Come on, Crusher. You can do it. Cheat. I'm not gonna cheat. The race is cheat. over, Crusher. We won. I'm not gonna. Wait, we won? <laughs> we won? <laughs> Woohoo! Congratulations, teammate. We knew you could do it, Crusher. And best of all, you did it without cheating. Yay for me! <laughs> no. Awesome. Now hang on. We're gonna ride some air currents. Caps, those aren't warm air currents. Those are cold air currents. Uh-oh. The cold air is pushing our hang glider down. Now we're flying too low to make it to the other side. Help me look for warm air that can lift our hang glider up higher. When you see a current of warm red air, say, warm air. lifted us higher. But we need to go even higher to get the baby cow back to her family. When you see a current of warm air, say, warm air. Warm air! Going up! We're almost 
almost there, little cow. We just need to get a little higher. When you see a current of warm air, say, warm air. Little cow? Moo! Moo! <gasps> it's Starless Ranch! And there's the barn! Yeah! Here we are! Alrighty, cows! You ready to see your new home? For these cows. Moo! Hey, hey, little cow, you having a good time? Moo! Moo! <laughs> I think she's saying thank you. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're welcome, little cow. <laughs> 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 